I'm standing in the uh, lounge of Baywatch Motels in Timaru and I'm overlooking a bay called Caroline Bay. It's absolutely fantastic. The local council spend a lot of money on this bay and it's very nice. But there's only one problem, we need more people. And, and to get more people we need to promote what's here. Okay? So my company is Timaru Tourist Promotions and I want to promote Timaru. So that's why I'm standing in here hoping the manager or the owner of this motel will give me some money so I can promote the place. Here they are, the Baywatch Motels. Absolutely fantastic, the view from there. Um, I think Lionel's his name, but um, he didn't give me any money. He didn't want to spend any money, so uh, I have to move on and find someone to support me. I found a new motel here in Timaru. It's Ron Bishop here from Timaru Tourist Promotions. I found a new motel, it's called the Harbour View. And I went and saw the lady there, but she spent all the money. She's uh, done all her advertising, so I'll go on and find another motel. I want one motel in Timaru to put on my Traveller's Guide website. Here's a business, there's a motel for sale. What's it called? Bay City Motor Lodge. Now if you want a good, you want a good motel, here it is. Come here and see the guy. He's got sole agency on it with someone else, but that's alright, go and see him anyway. This is the Benvenui Hotel. Comfort Hotel. I've uh, just been in there, saw a nice lady in there. And the owner's not here at the moment, he's in Christchurch. Uh, but I've got to come back next week and see him. And it's, it's got a gym in there, it's got everything in there. And it's a nice hotel. So I'll, I'll get back to you next week, okay? Ron Bishop here from Timaru Tourist Promotions. I'm down on Caroline Bay in Timaru. And I'm standing on a hill. And behind me is the Bay Watch Motels. Bay Watch Motels. He was the guy that didn't have any money to give me to promote him. So I've come up here to show you what you can see from his motels. There it is. It's called Caroline Bay, in Timaru, New Zealand. You know what? It's the best kept secret in the world. You know I know it's a secret? No people here. The place is empty. No people. This used to be New Zealand's great tourist resort. People used to come from all around the world to Caroline Bay. And now it's empty of people. You know why? Attitudes. It's all about the attitudes of people. Nobody wants to promote it. That. How'd you like that for a lounge? Overlooking this here. All this spectacular seaside. Used to be the great seaside resort in New Zealand. But now there's bugger all people. It's a shame. Never mind. We've got a new mayor. Things might change. The council's already spent the money. All we're going to do now is bring in the people. And I'm going to try to do that on my own. Travelersguide.co.nz Travelersguide.co.nz Timaru Tourist Promotions Limited State Highway 1 Business Directories. That's what I do. I promote all the businesses along State Highway 1. I found this sign on the side of the road. It says Timaru, telefriend.co.nz Affordable, accessible, just plain awesome. What the hell does that all mean? God almighty, someone's got some great imagination, haven't they? Here we are, Timaru newest motel is now open. What's it called? It's called Coastal Ridge. Affordable luxury motel apartments, 38 King Street and there are no vacancies tonight. They're full up. Must be good. I went in there to look for the manager but uh, he's not about and the owner is away somewhere so... Uh, I wasn't able to get any business. But anyway, I'll come back again another day. 
The newest motel in town has no reception area. You have to walk around the building looking for it. And then in the garage here, there's this little sign that says Coastal Ridge Reception. So it's all part of this other motel, which I think is called Cedar Motels. This is the Ashley Motor Lodge across the road. There's no vacancy there either. Uh, I went to see them a couple of times, but they don't seem to warm too good to me. They don't like me very much, so I wonder if I've got a new owner. I'll go and have a look. Yeah, no one there. Pinched, uh, uh, the, I rang the bell. No one came to see me. Uh, so I pinched a minty. They had some minties there. I got one of those. Moments like these, you need minties when you're looking for a motel to promote. Got sick of following motels, so I looked for a restaurant. The India down the bottom there, little Indian, uh, doesn't serve dinner till five, so they're closed at the moment. The Fusion restaurant and bar, the guy's on his break, so he couldn't see me. Montice Brewery Bar, bar Hill, that uh, Claire owns that and she's away at the moment, she's not on duty. Uh, next door is the Panorama Motel, Motor Lodge. There's no vacancy there, so I didn't bother going in because he doesn't need any more business. Uh, and the other one I saw was the Sea Breeze Motels. And of course the owner doesn't live on the premises. Yeah, the other business on the Bay Hill, of course, is the Hydro Grand Hotel. Uh, the owner of that lives out of Washdyke. He makes toothpicks. Him and his sister own it, and his sister lives in Wanaka. Okay, so there's not much point in going there because they haven't been open for 10 odd years and it's just going to sit there waiting for it to fall down.